Good day everyone. Today is Thursday, August 25, 2022. Please sing with me. You raised me up. When I am down and oh my soul so weary. When troubles come and my heart burden be, then I am still and wait here in the silence until you come and say the world with me. You raise me up so I can stand the mountains. You raise me up so walk on stormy seas. I am strong when I am on your shoulder. You raise me up to more than I can be. You raise me up so I can stand on mountains. You raise me up to walk on stormy seas. I am strong when I am on your shoulder. You raise me up to more than I can be. You raise me up so I can stand on mountains. You raise me up to walk on stormy seas. I am strong when I am on your shoulder. You raise me up to more than I can be. You raise me up so I can stand on mountains. You raise me up to walk on stormy seas. I am strong when I am on your shoulder. You raise me up to more than I can be. You raise me up to more than I can be. Be ready. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew, chapter 24, verses 42 to 51. At that time, Jesus said to his disciples, Watch, for you do not know on what day your Lord is coming. But know this, that if the householder had known in what part of the night that thief was coming. He would have watched and would not have let his house be broken into. Therefore, you also must be ready, for the Son of Man is coming at an hour you do not expect. Who then is the faithful and wise servant, whom his master 
has set over his household to give them their food at the proper time? Blessed is that servant whom his master, when he comes, will find so doing. Truly I say to you, he will set him over all his positions. But if that wicked servant says to himself, My master is delayed, and begins to beat his fellow servants, and eats and drinks with the drunken, the master of that servant will come on a day when he does not expect him and at an hour he does not know and will punish him and put him with the hypocrites their men will weep and gnash their teeth this is the gospel of the lord praise to you o lord jesus christ in today's reflection, God has made you the caretaker of his household, the dispenser of all his goods. As caretaker, God has enriched you with every grace and knowledge so that you are not lacking in any good work. If you have this sense of mission, Try your best to be diligent at it. God will certainly reward your faithfulness. Saint Monica is one such faithful servant who spent a lifetime of prayer and sacrifice for the conversion of her son, Augustine. Unless we treasure something. We may not find reason to protect and preserve it. Amen. Oh my God, I am sorry and beg pardon for all my sins and detest them above all things because they have crucified my loving Savior, Jesus Christ. And most of all, because they offend your infinite goodness, and I firmly resolve, by the help of your grace, never to offend you again, and carefully to avoid the occasion of sin. Amen. Let us pray in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Almighty Father, I praise and thank you for the unconditional love which you have been blessing upon our families and us. Father, your love for us nourishes our heart, gives purpose to our soul, and heals and calms all our worries and pains in life. Father, we need you always in our life. Your faithfulness is our security amid the tensions and anxieties around us and our strength in moments of self-doubt and exhaustion. We are sorry for our sins. Please help us to be faithful to you let us pray in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Almighty Father, we praise and thank you for the unconditional love which you have been blessing upon our families and us. Father, your love for us nourishes our heart, gives purpose to our soul, and heals and calms all our worries and pains in life. Father, we need you always in our life. 
Your faithfulness is our security amid the tensions and anxieties around us and our strength in moments of self-doubt and exhaustion. Please help us to be faithful to you through our words, thoughts, and actions. Also, enable us, Father, to make our dreams come true. If it is your will, bless us with a long and meaningful life. In all things, may our life gives glory to your divine majesty. For all of this we pray in the mighty name of Jesus, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless everyone, and thank you. Happy Thursday!